Well, good morning, YouTube. It is me, Brent, from Brent's Van Life. Waking up outside the shop, we decided to give the dude a little green space out front here, and I also got a text early this morning from the boys in the shop saying, you got stuff, so let's go check out the stuff. You got my stuff? I got your stuff. You got the stuff? Where's the stuff? It's out in the shop. Okay, let me go get it. Oh, what's this? It looks like stuff. And it looks like my stuff. Well, I better grab this stuff and take it out to the bus. This is the new AB15 quart set power portable refrigerator. These guys are awesome. Let's get it unpacked. Set power got a hold of me and asked me if I was interested in uh, checking out one of their newer products. Uh, this 15 quart portable 12 volt fridge will hold up to, I believe it's 15 or 18 cans of your favorite beverage. Plug it in, it can be a fridge or a freezer. And it's small enough to drag down to the beach. <laughs> It's in one of my favorite colors. Orange. This is my RV45 Pro I got from Set Power over a year ago. Still going strong. I love this thing. Dual compartments, one freezer, one refrigerator. But this is just an added artillery to my van life. Let's get this thing open. Looks like nice, easy controls. We open it up. All my goodies are in here. There is your arm strap. I will show that to you in a sec. It comes with a 110 and a 12 volt plug-in. We'll get that all pulled out. What else they got? Oh my goodness. Would you look at this? That, my friends, is an ice cube maker. Filler from the top, and let her freeze. The Set Power AB15. You should add this to your arsenal. So Set Power reached out to me and said, hey Brent, we have this cool fridge. Uh, it was going to be the PT45 or 55 quart 12 volt refrigerator system that comes with a battery pack. Here, check it out. So these two babies were going to be coming here in the. And I said, hey, I actually love the one that I have. So these two babies were going to be coming here in the... And I said, hey, I actually love the one that I have. But how would you like to help out a van lifer like me and give me something I can really truly use? That's why I asked them to go like, take me down a notch and give me something a little smaller. But what I really need is a new 12 volt plug for my old fridge because it's getting a little hacked up for me sliding it in and out. And they said, absolutely. And you know what else, Brent? We actually have the accessory. It's a slider station for your old fridge. 
we're going to ship you one of those too. And I was like, you guys are God sent. So I want to say thank you very much, setpowerusa.com, for checking this out. We're going to take this out. We're going to plug it in and check it all over. Let's get her done. This unit is really quick and easy plug and play. Right now, I'm just putting in the strap. Did I get it on right? Yeah. <laughs> Two plug-in ways. This is for a 110, which I have the luxury of having it over here. We'll take the 12 volt, plug it into the front of the fridge. This wire goes into your box. We'll plug it in. We'll turn on the inverter. We'll hit the power key. And it comes alive. Good golly. Comes with a interior light for your nighttime looking. The neat thing is it also has a 12 volt plug-in to plug into your car a lighter. And it has the same plug that goes on the front of this cool little cooler. Comes in two colors, blue and orange. Now you know why I picked orange. <laughs> to stand out. But as I do with all of my plug-in fridges, I usually like to put them in, plug them in in the home or a 110 volt plug-in system. And I like to see how quickly they get cold. So why don't we do that? This thing is uber, uber light until I fill it full of refreshments. <sighs> He's always so busy. Hey, I was wondering, sir, can I plug in my AB15 into your outlet in here in the office? You can. Awesome, thank you. So we're all plugged in and currently the inside temperature is 60 degrees, 62 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's see how long it takes to get down to that 32 mark. 10 after 10. I guess I should make sure it's set for zero, eh? <laughs> uh, when set power ships you your uh, fridge, they're usually set for zero degrees Fahrenheit, which I believe is minus 18 Celsius. So we're gonna turn this down to 32 degrees, or up to 32. Look at this day. It is gorgeous here on Vancouver Island. And I need to get this bus cleaned up and head up and do some laundry today. Um, so in the meantime, waiting for our new cooler to cool off and to clean this place up. Because as you can see during photo shoots, it gets pretty messy in here. Uh oh. I think this guy's for me. God, I hope so. We're hoping he gets the uh, fridge slider. Let's see. More stuff for Brent's man life. <laughs> look at that. And look at that. Uh, we are at my temperature, zero degrees Celsius in less than half an hour. I'm gonna guess it'll about 20 minutes. Hey, thanks again, Set Power. I am so stoked to be getting this. FedEx did deliver exactly what I was looking for. My RV 45 Pro slider, yeah. Oh, baby. Thanks a million, Sat Power. You don't know how much this is gonna help this poor old fella. Feels like Christmas. <laughs> oh yeah. I really don't have a lot of room to play with in here. So I'm hoping everything fits like a bug in a rug. Snug. 
That was all backwards. <laughs> Stuck as a bucket rug. Okay, let's get to it. Please fit the first time. Hey, that looks good, eh? Yeah, it got caught up on my rug. So I took the fridge off. We're gonna replace the fridge on top just to make sure I can open the lid. I might have to adjust my floor a little bit, but I'm smiling. Yes, thank you, Set Power. Okay, it's on and it's perfect. Oops, it's got one of these locks on it. Oops, oh, it's got two settings. Well, by the looks of it, I may have a little bit of adjusting to do. It fits too perfect. <laughs> okay, so what I did was I went and I got my laundry done. And on the way back, it's such a beautiful day here in the Nanaimo. It's time for this guy to go to the doggy park and burn off some of that energy. What do you think, dude? Come here. Hey, hang on. You ready? Come on. This is uh, the Nanaimo Dog Park. This is for the little ones, the little dogs. And um, behind me is the big dog park, which he usually likes. So he's just running around squirting here and there and seeing who's here. But as soon as he sees a big dog, he's going to want to go in here. Yeah. Of course, he's got to go for the biggest dogs in the park. No more big guys to play with, so he came over to these guys over here. See? Always to the biggest dog in the park. <laughs> well, that was fun for him. It was fun for me, too. I got to sit in the sun. But we have to get things done here. I need to get back on the road. This weather is calling me to be on the road. Uh, I have a few things I need to do here at the shop and then hopefully by the end of the day we'll be ready. First things first, put the laundry away. I believe it's time. I have a container like that, well that container, and uh, what I do is I swap out my winter t clothes for my summer clothes because I only have so much room in here and then I just store the other ones. So. It's time. <laughs> Out with some of the old and in with some of the new. Hey gang, oh my goodness, I cannot believe it. My head is twirling with so many things going on and the sun is pushing me at 110 miles an hour. Here's an update. The dude, well, he's chilling. The medication has been taken and winter clothes are in the box. We took the top off of the refrigeration cabinet, decided it was time to install a shelf in my bedroom. And I'm currently, ooh, sunny day. I'm currently, uh, I have to build spacers to lift the upper shelf off so that the refrigerator slides in and out easily. There we go. Basically, this is going to go on here like so. And that's all I need to lift it, I hope. I'll be screwing it straight onto here like this. It's not going to be seen. So, it's going to be good. <laughs> By everything. Oh, look at that shadow. It's getting to be messy again. Let's get to work. Another tight fit. <laughs> I really don't think I should be securing this quite yet, but you know what? It is what it is. Let's give it a shot. So, after changing the uh, head of the screwdriver, we got some screws in. 
Let's place the fridge in. Snug as a bug in a rug. I love it. Set power. You guys freaking rock. Sadly, however, um, the carpet that was here is a little too thick and catches on the fridge. There's something underneath it that catches the roof. Something. Causes it to bind up, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do there. Well, it's 7 o'clock. And uh, we got the garage cleaned out. But just in time as the sun is starting to set, I managed to uh, get my quarters cleaned up. I'm pretty proud of myself for getting so much accomplished today. I just need to eat now. And I need to move because this angle that I'm sitting on is no good. So we'll finish cooking up stuff. We'll finish cleaning up as I'm cooking. And we're going to see you guys tomorrow because that's it. I'm done. A quick little meat sauce. Fill my palate. And go to bed. Thanking set power. <laughs> You guys got me so excited this morning that I just spun like a top. So if you guys are looking for a fridge, accessories for fridges, batteries for fridges, go check out setpowerusa.com and check out the new AB15 and all the rest of their great products. I'm so happy to have that in my arsenal now as well as my slider for my RV45 Pro. Check those units out. Again, setpoweredusa.com.